Hi, welcome to another episode of 305 Fishing. Today, I will catch fish. Maybe a quality fish. Maybe a fish. I don't know. Uh, I'm sorry for the foul language in this video. It's, uh, it's kind of bad, you know. Uh, yeah, uh, I also uh, want to thank all three people who might watch the whole thing. Um, yeah, thanks. Uh, stay through to see me talk again. The giant from the knife. No, it's not. It's pickle. I don't want to lose the or the lure. He's pulling pretty good though. There we go. Pickerel. Number two of the day. I went fishing earlier and caught one. Alright. So we're on 19 inch. These guys are too bony to eat, so we're gonna have to put them back. There we go. Too bony. Another one. This one's a bat. No, no, no. Two cats in a row. Two pick row. Alright, this one might actually. This one's bigger. This one's about 20 in the shirt. There we go. There we go. Two fish and two casts. Not too bad. Got one. And it's a pick and I'm pretty sure. Oh, no, it's my first bass. I oh, this lake this year. Sweet. Oh, I got snag in the bushes up here. Oh my god, that's such a good feeling. Get my first bass out of here for the year. Or my first bass of the year. I've already gotten a six pounder under my belt. But, oh crap, that feels great. Oh, he's not even big. I'm not hype or anything, but I just feel great actually catching a bass out of here. Well, it's been all pit curl. Ooh, it's got nice teeth. Um, yeah, look at him though. That is a great thing to finally get one. I don't care how big he is, he's, he's the most I've caught this year. Alright, buddy, see ya. Hopefully, he lives. It's a pickerel. I think it's a pickerel. How sweet's a bass. Biggest bass out of this pond for me this year. Sweet. On that jig. He's very cool. It's my first. I mean, this is my biggest bass out of this lake this year. Pond. It's getting back in. Wow. Water release. I'm using a seven foot medium rod. Um, Berkeley amp rod. And this C Knight OS 2000 with 30 pound, 30 pound braid with a finesse jig, but it's not the usual setup I use, but I don't have my other rods with me. And I don't know where my jig rod is. So, yeah. Let's catch more. Hmm. Now, if you surf around for this part of the video, you 
You're there. Get ready to see one more trick show. Seven foot heavy action rod, 14 pound fluoro with a square bill. Okay, that's great. Alright. Wow, what a cast. The auto's, audio's probably going to be trash, so don't expect anything. First cast, and it's a four pounder. First cast, and it's a giant. Oh my god. First cast, and it's a giant. That's a four pounder. Holy fucking shit. That's a five pounder. Five pounder. Thank you. What? Thank you. Holy crap. First cast, and it's a freaking toad. Holy moly. Jeez. I'm sorry for the language, but holy crap. Let's weigh this sucker. God. He's a giant. All right, this scale's not going to be very accurate, but, you know, it gets a general idea. Four and a half, that's, that's what I thought, four or five. That's a nice fish. Holy crap. That was my first cast. I, oh my God. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Holy crap, that's a big girl. Big boy. Girl. Full of eggs. There we go, girl. Holy freaking God. First cast. Oh. Let's see if we can go two for two. Oh my gosh. Scum. How can it all make sense when I got me? Alright, next cast. Here we go. Let's see what we get now. Alright, nothing. Um, let's see if I can get more fish. Holy crap. Cup, if you thought the shot over there was, eh, I can do that. You can't do this. You probably could, but I just wanted to make myself look cool. I threw a trick shot like that. Gotta have some water. Keep your bones healthy. Keep you hydrated for your next trick shot. Or when you're going fishing, too. You know? Either one can work. Delicious.